everyone i'm back again today with another video and today your girl is sharing with you what i got for christmas cheers how are you guys doing today i am doing quite well and you guys today i would i thought that i would share with you what i got from for christmas to myself and from my loved ones if you're interested in this type of content just keep on watching. so you guys I got a few things. Um, I'm gonna start off with the miscellaneous gift cards that I received. I got a Starbucks gift card. I got another Starbucks gift card. I got a huge, this is like $300 Lululemon gift card. I got another gift card from Lululemon. This actually came in the old school Lululemon like packaging, this nice little packet pouch that Lululemon used to give like with gift cards like what i'm so happy that um my brother who gave this to me was able to get it in this pouch but yeah cute so a bunch of lululemon gift cards a bunch of starbucks gift cards like my people know me okay <laughs> and yeah i got that i got some money and yeah so those were the gift cards and then for the items i have i gifted myself two of these items and the other few were from my very generous husband and let's get into it. So I actually saw this release. This released like right around, literally I think one week before Christmas. It sold out instantly. I caught it on a restock. I kind of blind bought it because like, hello, look at this packaging. And I so I blind bought it and I was like, whatever, if I don't like it, I'll return it. But I knew I would like it because I read the notes on it. And this, you guys, is so nice. This was the best blind buy that I've done. Um, this is Tom Ford's vanilla set. And I got the 30 ml bottle. Um, so it's just a one ounce. Um, how pretty, like what? If I was a perfume bottle, I would be this. Love the coloring of this. How beautiful. Look at this like matte gold nozzle. So, so pretty. It's a little bit like see-through-y, kind of like how like his um, lost, what Tom Ford lost cherry is. So, so nice, you guys. I'm obsessed with this packaging and it, oh my God, I just sprayed it on myself because I literally just got it in the mail, but oh my God, it smells like, it smells like heaven. It's like syrupy and warm and vanilla-y, very sweet, very gourmand. If you're into gourmands, if you're into sweet fragrances, you're gonna love this. This is so, so, so nice. And this will be like my fourth Tom Ford fragrance. I'm, I'm obsessed with his fragrances. And you know, I just got myself the small bottle, but honestly, I probably should have gotten the bigger one because I love this, like, so so good give this a try if it's in your local sephora or like uh, nordstrom or something because it's really really nice and it keeps selling out it just keeps selling out it's it always has like a restock alert give it a try but this was from me to me next you guys um this was another fragrance that i bought myself but this was so this fragrance i actually purchased um earlier like i think during black friday because they were doing all these crazy sales on fragrances i'm pretty sure i got this from Saks, but this is perfume de marley's valaya and this is actually the first perfume de marley fragrance that i have purchased and look at this bottle i mean you guys these fragrance houses are giving they're giving with the bottles like how beautiful is this valaya is such an interesting scent it's a it's very complex um it's a complex scent it is like fresh but sweet but warm it's i am gonna link it down below and i'll include the notes but give valaya a try this is one of their newer fragrances um and i know they're well known for delina and i think oriana but valaya is like i feel like valaya is slept on you guys need to give valaya a smell when you are at your local sax or Nordstrom because it's really, really, really nice. This was from Hubby. And you guys, these were nice. These were actually, he got them on sale. I actually found them and um, yeah, he got them for me, but I don't even know the name of these. Um, they're like not on the box, but I am gonna link them down below if I could find them. They were on sale, so I might not be able to, but they're Prada shoes, okay? Prada box. 
um how cute are these you guys i'm gonna get so much wear out of these as you guys know i have the prada re-edition bag the 2005 version with the leather like handle this goes perfectly with them that's the name of them they're the logo thong sandal for 875 dollars he didn't pay that they were like half off or more than half off on clearance um from sex but how cute is this this is like um patent leather the inside is just regular leather the prada plating but it's very subtle because it's in this nude color so you kind of can't see it from afar and that's what i appreciate it's a square like rounded off toe box tiny little heel on the bottom but they're you know they're just like nice they're nice to have because this would match a lot of my outfits especially during the summertime or when you go out on vacation and these they just look really nice you guys i'm obsessed and he got them for me in a 36 and that is my size they fit perfect they fit perfectly true to size sometimes in italian shoes i end up having to size down which is weird like i'll end up being a 35 or a 35 and a half but these were true to size i am a u.s size six these are a 36 um full for him being so generous and purchasing those for me and then he also got me a pair of another pair of Prada shoes because these were also on sale. But these are the, y'all, I'm going to butcher that. So here, that's what they are, okay? And they're in a size 36. You guys, they're essentially the same thing as those. They are the heeled version. Look at this. Look at that. They are not patent. They're all just like kind of like this box leather. Same Prada logo. These were on clearance, you guys. So they're not like the best packaged or the best looking. But like how cute. Very elegant little three inch heel. Little Prada logo in the back there. Um, I don't know how much he paid for them, you guys. But and I'm pretty sure these were like a floor sample. They say they're $1,200. These were not $1,200, you guys. They These were on steep, steep discount. But I'm obsessed because I really feel like I can wear these during the day. Like they are just a perfect daytime heel. They're not too high. They're not too obnoxious. They're not loud. And they're in this beautiful, beautiful nude color that I think is complementary to my skin tone. I am obsessed and very, very grateful and lucky to have owned this and very thankful to have these. So you guys, I did do an unboxing of this. So I will insert the video, but you guys, I was a bad girl. Um, I I was a bad girl. Um, this personal shopper that I work with sometimes on um, on Saks, she works for Saks. She um, showed me this, and I was like, okay, I want it. I need it. I mean, I don't actually need anything. None of us need any of this stuff, but it was just perfect because you guys, I have been waiting for this to come back in stock. It's so hard to find. It's just like one of those things. I don't know why. Chanel's holiday packaging this year is just so beautiful. This is a velvety kind of feeling material with the gold. And look at how cute this little charm is. So cute. I see people are so creative. People are using them as a brooch. I know some people are using them as a bracelet. Someone made it as a ring. Very, very pretty. But how cute is this as a brooch, right? Um, but yeah, you guys, I I got this. And finally, finally, I was able to find it. Um, this is the dust bag it came in. Here it is, you guys. It's, um, you know, nothing crazy. It's just a... I don't even have the receipt in here. I don't know why I put the receipt, but... Let's see if the tag's in here. Yeah, it's in here. This is the medium size O case in black slash burgundy. Essentially a pouch, right? But it's like an oversized pouch, so I feel like I'm going to use it as a clutch. Um, but yeah, it's in caviar leather in the black grained leather. This um, is in gold hardware, like gold hardware. The inside is burgundy, but it's just in this fabric. Very, very nice. I'm going to get use out of this. I either can use it for travel to store things in, but I probably won't. Like I'm telling you, I'm going to use this as a clutch, even though it's like not meant to be. I don't care, you guys. It's cute. 
and the back has the beautiful mona lisa pocket just how their classic flaps do the leather is buttery soft i'm obsessed and i feel very blessed and fortunate to be able to have sourced this during the holiday season and i picked it up for myself gift from me to me and that's it you guys i have nothing more to share with you for now Tell me down below what you guys got for christmas this year i would love to know these videos are so fun to me and as always if you're interested in this type of content please consider subscribing i would love to have you here share this video with your friends and family come on back down below i also recently started an ltk shop please consider following me on there and shopping my looks through there I will talk to you guys soon in my next video. Cheers. Peace.